So many people I know and so many clients that I work with have bad relationships with public speaking. Maybe, and it's all, it's funny, isn't it? Like there's so many childhood memories where immediately if it comes to mind again, you go back to that place. The reassuring thing is, is that you are an adult now and you have had so much life experience, so many things that you can do, so many lessons that you've learned. And you can work with that inner child version of yourself who's like, don't make me do it. I don't want to do it because this one time I did this. Like I've got so many of, I mean, millions of those examples. Uh, Me doing the splits on the stage in front of my entire school and splitting my trousers. Uh, Falling off my chair in the middle of an English class. Uh, Standing up really believing I had the right answer and it was wrong and a teacher completely humiliating me. We can carry all of these layers, all of these old wounds and they can really affect our business. So I want to help you to refresh this and instead of leaning on all of the kind of little scars that you've got over the years of like no I don't want to do it so I definitely can't I've been burnt once so I'm not going to do it again when I did this work on myself the amount of times I realized some of those scars were over 30 years old it was time to let them go also the experience I had built up since then um, overrides all of those things so if you want some gentle kindly support Um, come on over and let's reframe your relationship with public speaking so you can make the money you want, you can grow your business in a way that feels great and of course deliver that amazing impact all around the world. All the options are in the description. Come and join Speak Up and I'll see you in there. Bye.